Oke, okay. uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We are group 7 and today we will present about accounting for assets and liabilities tax amnesty. Next. Agenda. Okay, today uh, the objective we are talking about today is uh, background of study and second standard content and illustration. A summary of PS AK70. Companies can choose to use PS AK25 or use the special provision of PS AK70. Initial recording of asset or liabilities from tax amnesty, following the applicable accounting standards, recognize the tax amnesty asset or liability in accordance with the provision of PSAK 25 for error. Correction as a consequence so that a correction will be made the return earnings. Following the specific provision in PSAK 70, recognize asset and liabilities for the amount of assets reported in the tax amnesty certificate additional paid in capital. For the next measurement, follow the applicable PSAK or continue to use the measurement that have been met. And if a measurement is met, the difference in the value will be reported in additional paid in capital. The objective. The objective of uh, PSAK 70 is arrange a treatment accountancy on assets and liabilities incurred from forgiveness tax in accordance with the law number 11 of 2016 concerning forgiveness tax or forgiveness act tax. Room scope. In determine, determine is the entity recognizes assets and liability forgiveness tax in his finance if entity follow provision in the forgiveness act tax. Entity apply condition in the statement this if entity recognize asset and liability forgiveness tax in report his finance. Statement it can be applied by entities that use SAK at top. Definition. Forgiveness asset tax are asset the that arise from forgiveness tax based on certificate forgiveness tax cost acquisition of forgiveness as a tax is as a tax is asset value based on certificate forgiveness tax liability forgiveness tax is liability related direct directly with the acquisition of forgiveness as a tax forgiveness as tax is the legion tax that should be owed no charge, penalty administration taxation, and penalty crime in the field of taxation by means of disclose assets and pay money ransom as set in the Forgiveness Act tax. Certificate Forgiveness Tax Certificate is published later by Minister Finance as proof give forgiveness tax. In thing, in a period 10 days, time work counted signs that the ship of affidavit treasure of for forgiveness tax, Minister Finance are appointed official or name Minister Finance, not yet published certificate. Then, statement letter of treasure for forgiveness tax considered as certificate. And statement letter treasure for forgiveness tax or statement letter treasure is a letter used by must tax for disclose asset, liabilities, and net asset value, and counting and payment money ransom. ransom. Money ransom is among many paid to state treasury to get forgiveness tax. Okay, the next. Accounting policy. This standard provides an option for entity at initial recognition to measure tax, amnesty assets, and liabilities according to the first is applicable PSAK more than PSAK 25 and more part 6. And the second is special provision are set out 
in a part 10 until 23. The application of accounting policy option is carried out consistently for all recognized tax amnesty asset and liabilities. Measurement moment confusion beginning. Forgiveness asset tax measure at cost acquisition forgiveness asset. Cost acquisition of forgiveness asset tax is deemed cost to be best for entity in do measurement after confession early. Liability forgiveness tax measure at liability contractual for deliver cash or equivalent cash for complete related obligation directly with the acquisition of forgiveness as a tax. And difference dif between the asset of forgiveness tax and liability forgiveness tax recognized in post edition paid in a capital inequity. Among the no cool recognized as a profit make a loss less or reclass reclassified to be balance profit. Ransom pad recognized in if you can deliver it will be to Nazi Okay uh, you can hear my hello Hello, Tess. Hello, Tess. Hello. Okay. Uh, thank you, Zikri. Uh, I uh in in my change, I will uh continue. Uh, presentation of uh, Zikri about measurement moment confession beginning. Okay, uh, entity do adjustment on balance claim, uh, tax asset deferred and provision in profit make a loss on certificate period be delivered according to the pardon law tax or tax amnesty yeah, uh, as a uh, consequence loss right uh, that have been recognized as claim on advantage uh, payment tax on tax asset uh, deferred on accumulation make a loss tax not yet compens compensate uh, and provision tax before apply that uh, apply statement this okay uh, the next is uh, measurement after confession uh, beginning. Measurement after confession initial asset and liability uh, in tax amnesty, uh, tax amnesty yeah, uh, referred to on the relevant SAK. Uh, however, no limited on uh, number one is property investment in PSAK uh, uh, 13. Uh, stock in PSAK 14, investment on uh, association and venture together uh, in PSAK 15, uh, fixed asset in PSAK uh, 16, intangible asset in PSAK 19, and instrument finance in PSAK uh, 55. Okay, uh, they continue uh, measurement after convention beginning. Uh, entity award, uh, but no required for major return asset and liability forgiveness tax or tax amnesty, yeah, uh, based on mark reasonable according to SAK on certificate date. Uh, difference measurement return among mark uh, reasonable on that letter description with cost acquisition of asset and liability uh, tax amnesty uh, that has recognized proficiously uh, customized in balance additional paid in capital. Mark result measurement return become uh, best new for entity in apply provision measurement after convention early. If uh, amnesty, uh, tax amnesty result in entity get control according to PSAK uh, 65 
as long as a period measurement come back uh, then entity required a measure return asset and liability in forgiveness uh, in tax amnesty on that letter description period measurement return start uh, start after certificate date until uh, 30 31 uh, December uh, 2000, 2017 17 uh, if entity is not entity under common control apply PSAK 22 combination business and if entity under common uh, control apply PSAK uh, 38 combination business entity command control entity apply procedures uh, consolidation in accordance with PSAK uh, 65 since measurement return from that letter description until before apply procedures uh, consolidation entity required measure investment on child by using method cost uh, cost method difference measurement return among mark reasonable on a certificate with a value that has been uh, recognized previously adjust in uh, balance additional paid in capital okay uh, the next topic is termination of recognition uh, entity apply cr criteria termination convention uh, on each uh, each asset and liability uh, tax amnesty in accordance with the provision in ESAKA for its uh, asset type and liability debt. Uh, in presentation, uh, asset and liability forgiveness tax or tax amnesty served by separate of asset and liability other in report position finance. Uh, if choose policy special and no do measurement back uh, in paragraph uh, in paragraph 19, uh, serve in accordance current asset classification and no flat of fluent as well as liability period short and long. Uh, if can do separation classified as asset not fluent and liability uh, period long in paragraph uh, 19, entity reclassify asset and liability forgiveness tax or tax amnesty previously according to paragraph uh, 19 uh, key and asset post and liability similar when uh, entity measure return asset and liability in tax amnesty entity get control uh, entity self return report finance clauses uh, previously if that report finance is after a uh, certificate date uh, not do each other wipe between asset and liability forgiveness tax or tax amnesty. Disclosure, uh, disclosure in PSAK, PSAK 70 uh, consists of that certificate and among recognized as an asset of forgiveness tax, uh, tax amnesty based on certificate as well as Total liability for give, uh, total liability tax amnesty. In the next topic is provision trans, uh, transition and debt effective. Entity apply provision in PSAK 25 uh, uh, policy accounting, change uh, estimate accounting and error paragraph uh, 41 until uh, 53. If choose option in accordance. Uh, accordance according to paragraph uh, 6 uh, general PSAK entity apply statement this by prospective if choose option convention special in paragraph 7 uh, report finance for period before that effective statement this no need serve back uh, state statement apply since that ratification of the tax amnesty Okay, the next uh, topic is impact of PSAK 70 to financial statement. Uh, in example, in our example is PT Wahana Pro Natural TBK or uh, in 
2016 uh, PT Wahana Pro Natural TBK in Indonesian Stock Exchange code is WAPO. Okay. Uh, before our uh, discuss about PT WAPO, uh, cause PT WAPO more than more than banyak dari kita itu enggak uh, enggak tahu ya uh, about PT WAPO. I will to explain PT WAPO uh, brief ya. Oke. Okay. History and uh, brief profile PT WAPO or Wahana Pro Natural TBK. Uh, Wahana Pro Natural TBK or WAPO was established in Indonesia uh, Indonesia on August 7 uh, 90, 1993 and commence commercial activities on August 7 uh, 20 uh, and August 7 1993 the head office of WAPO is domiciled in Jakarta okay PT WAPO has changed its names uh, in several times including PT Golden Phoenix PT Wahana Yuda Mandiri as May Uh, 1996 uh, PT Wahana Ponix Mandiri as of January uh, 31st 2000 and the last one uh, is Wahana Pro Natural TBK as of August uh, 1st 2012 shareholder who own uh, 5%, 5% or more of Wahana Pro Natural or WAPO including PT Hijau Sari, Hijau Sari uh, 19%, PT Surya Pelangi Mandiri uh, 19%, PT Mitra Niaga Sakti 10% and PT Pesona Bangun Mandiri 10%. Based on companies article of association, the scope of WAPO's activity in uh, trading, transportation and agribusiness. WAPO main WAPO's main activity is trading in the main commodities of agricultural and marine product, including dried uh, seaweed, coffee, uh, chocolate, and candy. Uh, on June 22, uh, 2000 for, uh, 2001, WAPO conduct uh, an IPO or initial public offering in, paid in Indonesian Stock Exchange. Uh, with total of uh, 20, 200 million ordinary shares with a nominal value uh, 100 rupiah and with an offering price of uh, 175 rupiah. The initial public offering was also accompanied, accompanied uh, by issuance of uh, 50 million series series one warrants. The warrants have an exercise period of three years and can be exercised from December 21st 2001 to June to, uh, 21st 2004. Okay, uh, for study case of PT Wapo, uh, we'll present first by uh, Zikri to Zikri times is Time is yours. Okay, thanks, Nazif. I will continue uh, Nazif presentation. So the next we will discuss we will discuss about Pesaka 70. This is Pesaka provides a content treatment for assets and liabilities from tax amnesty in accordance with law number 11 in uh, 2016 about tax amnesty or tax amnesty law which become effective on July 1 20, 2000, 2016 PSAK 70 provides option in the initial recognition of the asset or liabilities arising from the implementation of the tax amnesty law whether to follow the irrelevance existing as according to the nature of 
the assets or liabilities recognized stated in PSAK 70 paragraph 6 or general approach or to follow the provision stated in PSAK 70 in the paragraph 10 to 23. So the, the paragraph 10 to and 20 um, is, is the optional approach. Decision, the, the decision made by the entity must be consistent for all recognized tax amnesty assets and uh, liabilities. Uh, the tax amnesty assets are measured at acquisition cost based on tax amnesty acknowledgement letter or we said SKPP. Tax amnesty liabilities are measured at a contractual obligation to deliver cash or cash equivalents to settle the obligation directly related to the acquisition of tax amnesty asset. So the next will be uh, explained by Nazif. To Nazif, time is yours. Okay, thank you, Zikri. Uh, that is, uh, this is the statement of financial position of PT Wapo in 2016 uh, in asset sites, yeah, uh, because it, uh, I look in annual report uh, that uh, consists of two pages. Uh, so I want to uh, provide in this slide is asset site. Okay, in as in asset set aside, uh, we can look that uh, in PT Wapo, uh, there there are uh, forgiveness tax asset uh, in two thousand and sixteen is one hundred million rupiah because the PT Wapo Indonesia PT Wapo PT Wapo uh, is joined with uh, tax energy program in 2016 and that's uh, and because the uh, DPT Wapo recognize that uh, can influence to uh, liabilities and uh, other uh, financial statement yeah financial statement uh, such as uh, income statement so uh, we can look at uh, liabilities and equity side. Okay, this is equity uh, liabilities and equity side. Uh, we can look that uh, in PT Wap in PT Wapo financial statement uh, or in statement of financial positions. Uh, there is a uh, Influ uh, that can influence yeah, influ to uh, tax amnesty program. So we can look at a uh, statement of financial position. Uh, the program of tax amnesty uh, can, inf uh, can influence by PSAK 70. 70. Okay. Uh, the description of a uh, statement of financial position will be present by Zikri. Uh, okay, uh, this is the income statement. In income statement, uh, we can look that uh, income statement that uh, apa namanya, yang terpengaruh gitu, terpengaruh sama uh, si si, uh, si tax amnesty ini. Jadi, so uh, in income statement will we can look that uh, can influence yeah, can influence by PSAK 70 okay uh, the next will present by uh, Zikri okay thank you Nazif so I will present about the tax amnesty of WAPO so based and on the Tax amnesty certificate. Uh, we we can see it, and at this slide, there's uh, there's have a number 
uh, number or and the, the titles and the company has uh, participated in the tax amnesty program based on the tax amnesty letter the assets that become the object of the tax amnesty are as shown in the image on the side uh, we can see in the in the picture and this this have a uh, nama harta yeah, presiden usaha yeah there is a, the there is the example so the company has paid a ransom of uh, 2 million uh, rupees on 7 september 2016 for the accounting records of this asset the company applies PSAK 70 accounting for tax amnesty asset and liabilities in a paragraph 7 which implies that the assets in the tax amnesty program are recorded as tax amnesty asset. In accordance with the paragraph 7 of PSAK 70, the company applies the accounting records of the tax amnesty asset prospectively. So, uh, so the the next is company sustainability. Uh, look, uh, we can see it in the in the income statement uh, of the PT Wahana Pranatura Alwapo. Yeah, uh, in this company has a suffered an operating loss in two thousand eleven of of fifth. Uh, 50, 56 miliar, yeah. and the company started to rise in uh, the 2014 after the company participated in the tax amnesty program and the implementation of PSAK 70 accounting for tax amnesty assets and liabilities in 2016, which resulted in the right of the deferred tax on accumulated loss uh in the in the 10 billion yeah, yeah plus plus yeah so which was recognized as different tax expense in a profit or loss for the period the company current years loss as of december 31 in the at the 2016 was is uh 9 billion the loss in 2016 caused the accumulated deficit as of December 31 in, at uh, 2016 to be a uh, 58 billion. So next, uh, and and this has a result in doubts about the company's ability to maintain its business continuity in an appropriate period of time to maintain the viability of the company management has a prepared a plan and taken steps to continue the company's operational activities the steps that will be developed are the first is build market markets and develop other product variants and the second is maintain financial flexibility and build a stable financial structure and the third is collect all receivables that are still outstanding so that the financial condition is stable okay uh, that's all for that's all our presentation presentation i hope you understand uh, uh, discussing for discussing today and thanks and see you thank you